Hello everyone, this is Phil from uh, Phil Good Gaming. How are you? Um, today, um, I, I, th uh, I was thinking about uh, making a video and the video that I wanted to make is a video to help new players of EVE Online. And uh, since I'm a new player myself, um, like I wanted to share the limited knowledge that I have um, of this game and uh, give you like the um, new player perspective that I have from this game. So uh, like I've been playing for only a week but in a week I have learned a lot and I took the time also to go on the internet and go on YouTube to watch uh, like YouTubers that uh, make videos uh, just like me about uh, EVE Online and it really helped me out. So uh, first of all, like I wanted to, to tell you that uh, when I started, uh, well you go through the creation uh, process of your, of your character and then after that I uh, strongly suggest you to go through all the tutorials that uh, there's available in the game at the beginning. So do them all, uh, take the time to uh, learn the basics of navigation, uh, you know, uh, um, targeting and moving around and the tutorial are there to help you and if you have difficulty you can go on the internet like I said and go on the YouTube and some people have made videos to help you out. And further on, uh, like I did, I suggest you to uh, to join a corp. Um, you uh, can join a corporation um, and m uh, many of those players that are in those corporations are veteran so they can help you out also by uh, giving you uh, direct information. So I'm gonna continue the video and uh, show you a little bit uh, about my uh, my venture here and I'm gonna do a little bit of mining just like the basics. So first of all I want to show you my my fit. Um, like I said in one week I've been playing <laughs> uh, relatively a lot. Um, so you know here I have uh, two minor two um, mining lasers. Um, like you have to to get the, the you can have the minor type 1 or tech 1 it's gonna be uh, okay but um, if you increase the the tech level you will yield more uh, ore per uh, per second like here I have a hundred and sixty six cubic meter per sixty seconds so if you have minor one let's say or others you might yield less so you make less money but uh, what you have to do if you want to go into the mining uh, career you have to have uh, mining lasers that's what you use to uh, mine ore. I have here a salvager uh, that salvager is uh, useful when you um, have destroyed a, uh, um, a NPC like a non-personal character that will attack you and you will salvage their uh, their wreck and sometimes you have uh, pretty good uh, stuff that will uh, drop from that and um, as, as you can see here I have good shield extenders uh, shield um, like invulnerability that uh, give me a, re a resistance of 25 percent on every type of damage so I have a pretty tanky fit, a pretty tank fit on that venture uh, that allows me to uh, survive if I've g I'm getting attacked by the NPCs and I also have drones uh, which I have um, I'm gonna show you it's there right here, right here, hobgoblins and if and uh, those, those uh, drones are there to help you to kill the targets for you while you mine and if you want to know how to get or what are the requ requirements for every thing that there is in the game you go under info right right click on the item you go on show info and then and you go under the requirements tab 
And under that, it says what skill you need to learn to operate or to use that particular item. And if you want to know what, where are your skills, you have to go here in your character. You go into skills, and these are all your skills. So you have to train them, and you add them into a queue. So let's say here, my name up upgrades is a uh, 39 days and 39 minutes I would put it there so here like for the uh, the Abgoblin it's light drone operation drone 3 so those are the skills that you have to do to 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 have them so it's the same thing for um, let's say you're mining lasers we'll go back here right click show info requirements you need mining uh, level 4. So if you want to increase that mining level 4, you go back. And if you don't see them in there, you can search here. Mining. And you can go as my skills and uh, mining right here. So I have level 4. And the yellow uh, dot here is for Omega and I'm a Alpha clone. So I cannot train. If I want to have mining 5, I would have to upgrade my account to an Omega. So that's about it's about that. So I'm gonna don't want to make a too long video. So that's what I understand, and that's very much the basics. So we're gonna go and mine outside. So we're gonna undock, and also um, like if you want to have more information about the 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 game I will set a link uh, in the description of this video but uh, you can go on uni or uni wiki uh, for uh, information about EVE Online they give you builds uh, what to do how to do the one-on-one -on -one basics so okay so we're gonna go in um, and mine here so I'm gonna go in my mining tab and we're gonna cho choose this belt so I click and I will warp to it. Make a sharp right turn and let's go. So if you want to mine you have to go to the to a asto asteroid belt and once you arrive you can see in the area like if there is enemies there's not it's in my PvP tab no for the the overviews and the PvP tabs and all those things I went on the internet to have that I'll make a separate video to explain to you but so now you can see the asteroids that they are around here so I choose always the most expensive asteroids and here it's rich Plagio class. So you select, you click, you select. You have to go um, like uh, you have to approach it. And before mining, you have to target or lock target to activate your uh, your mining lasers. So you go. towards that that um, or so when the range is going to be able you see it uh, it lighted up so I can target it so now it's locked it's right there and then I can use my mining uh, mining lasers here it says f1 or f2 or you can simply click on them F1, F2. So now I am mining. Um, uh, so like all the time that it will take to complete um, the mining process, if you want to know, well, they will tell you that uh, the uh, the asteroid is depleted, or your uh, cargo your uh, cargo hold. Sorry. Um, is going to be uh, full so you cannot have more ore in it and to know where it is you press Alt C 
which it pops the inventory and you go into or hold click on that you wait for a complete cycle of your two miners and they will appear in here so let's give it a few seconds again so you see uh, I have 946 of plagio class so every tick on both mining laser will increase that with that uh, number so it's 946 every tick so two times and so on and so on and the maximum capacity that you can have if is 5000 cubic meters so when that is is full you go and drop it so that's what I suggest you to do um, to get uh, the more ore possible and you warp with your full cargo to uh, the, the closest station or the station that, that you want to just to, to drop it in the, uh, the mining uh, or the uh, hangar, item hangar. You, you've put that there and you can sell it later on. So let's say if you have those, uh, those uh, dr um, drones with you and you have the skills, you can uh, launch them. So you right click on, you can launch one at a time, you know, or you right click this one, launch drone. If you want to do it a little bit faster, you go on the tab up top and you click launch drones, the two, so they will be launched at the same time. So there will be orbiting you and defending you in case there's there's uh, enemies or NPCs that come to attack you. And if you want to set up their attitude, you have aggressive, and I suggest you to do focus fire because if you don't uh, focus fire, uh, you will spread the damage. And damage spread is going to take more time for an NPC to to blow up. So focus fire. And I've set it to aggressive also. So that's 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 how I do. And um, another thing that I wanted to say uh, about this game is uh, I have a pretty bad experience. Um, it, it happened to me yesterday, and I wanted to share that with you. Uh, I was victim of what they called a suicide ganking. Um, so I was mining here in that area, you know, and it's in uh, sector. F uh, 0 0.5 and there was an enemy bomber that come from nowhere and he attacked me and destroyed my my venture and my venture was pretty uh, well equipped a little bit like I have and this venture is worth 4.9 million right now so maybe my last one it worth like uh, 5.7 so what I wanted to share with you guys or uh, with the new players is like this will happen to you at any moment, you know. So you have to be to be to be ready for that. And what I've experienced also is like I said I was playing Star Wars Knight of the Old Republic, I was playing World of Warcraft and you know you die often and you have sometimes you have to repair your armor or whatever, but the feeling of loss for me was bigger in this game uh, compared to the other game that I've just mentioned and the thing is uh, when you lose or when you get a ship destroyed like everything that have uh, that has in it and all the time that it took you to mine to get the isk the time you have invested to have it it's all it all disappears so it's it's uh, the feeling of, lo of loss is, is bigger and I just wanted to, to warn you about that because um, it happened to me and to be honest I was like <laughs> I was pissed okay but I understand that it's part of the game it's part of this game and if you cannot um, accept the fact that you're gonna lose ships and gon gonna lose money and gon you're gonna lose uh, let's say part of your time then really consider uh, playing or not playing this game but um, it's, it's it's very fun and I think that it's a process like step by step uh, 
I'm mining here and later I'm gonna do some PvP and maybe I'm gonna blow up other pe other people so it's it's just gonna be a payback time so but when you start sometime it's difficult because you have to learn how to play the game and at the se at the same time you're an easy target and people kill you so yeah that's what I wanted to sell you to tell you so let's stop um, mining here I'm gonna call my drones back so right click return drone to bay they're returning to me and then uh, like I said when you you had let's say that I had a, a full cargo hold what I suggest you is you go to a station the closest I'm gonna go to my station which is my H HQ of my uh, corporation and you click on it and then you, s you set the dock and when you click dock the process of docking is gonna be automatic because if you would click here select uh, the, your station whatever you want to go and you would warp you would only stay outside of it without docking so you don't want to stay outside and maybe another be a perfect victim like hey I'm here you can kill me you know so I suggest you to to dock as soon as possible then uh, you go in your uh, your station and then you unlock your you unload I would say your um, the ore that you have harvested or mine so what you do is you open up your tabs alt C and then alt G for the uh, item hanger you go into ore hold which where the uh, the ore is click and you drag it down and uh, like you can see I have some so I right click on it stack all and I like to sort by quantity reversed like this so you put your your ore in it and and um, like you you stack up you go outside on dock and you resume you go to the same belt or the uh, the other area and you mine you mine go back and forth so you will be able to make a lot of isk, a lot of money, and with that you will be able to improve your game, like buy skills, buy um, mining lasers, you will be able to buy new ships and everything. So I'm gonna stop here because it's gonna be a too long video. Um, I hope I, uh, this video had, has helped you as a new uh, player, and uh, I hope I didn't discourage you to play with my um, ganking, uh, suicide ganking adventure that I had recently, but um, like uh, it's a very fun game. I, I really like it. So I'm gonna make no new videos. Click the like button and subscribe also to my channel. That will uh, uh, really help me, and it will be really appreciated. So um, see you to into the next video. Bye.